Mud Hen Tavern is this, the newest restaurant that I've opened. It's named after my hometown, Toledo, for the mm -hmm. Mud Hens. Nice. A minor baseball league team. And it's just a great tavern with comfort food that's about community and neighbors. Right. And you don't have to make reservations inside. You can come and sit at a booth, have a great beer. Good, because I'm coming tonight and I'm not re making reservations. Okay, but just let you know I'll be there. Oh, yeah. Don't, don't, don't make me nervous. I need more of this. Okay. So right. what, what are we cooking today? Two of your favorite dishes. Just yeah, the these menu, are like right? two of the biggest selling dishes on the menu. This is our chicken croquette and waffles. So it's a chicken and waffles dish that is so Oh, fabulous. now you get it. Oh, now you understand why I'm so excited. And they gotta look at me like, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> and green eggs and ham, like the most delicious deviled I eggs I eat ever. eggs every day. So this is okay. very exciting Green to me. Okay. How can I Are help? you ready to work? I'm ready to work. Okay. I'm you working, cook? chef. All right. I do cook okay. a bit. Okay, I do well, like here. cooking. So we've got here, we've got the mixture, which is the mm -hmm. ground chicken, and we caramelized onions, mm -hmm. and garlic, and a little bit of paprika, or cayenne if you yeah. want it spicy, and then a little bit of either bacon or turkey bacon or whatever. But I just wanted to see, I heard you had good knife cutting skills. I wanted to see, really. Okay, don't cut your hand off. Okay, keep your fingertips bent under. Keep your finger. Oh my God. Keep your fingertips. How do you want me to cook it? Use your. Oh my God. No one's okay. ever taught me. I just watch okay, you here. on TV. Use. Okay, yeah. Use your third knuckle as a guide. You do this with a rocking motion, just like that. Go ahead, keep going. <laughs> and then you just turn it all around and you just do that, just like that. And then you get this nice little dice, and then we just throw it in here. Thanks. Okay. I did a great job. <laughs> you did. I did a wonderful job. So it's the third knuckle. Third All right, got knuckle. It. Okay, now we're gonna be making these chicken waffles. Now, you're gonna do it the old-fashioned way. I'll mm -hmm. use this. Oh man, you're not giving me a pass today. Okay, get okay, it. I can make do as that. little for, we're gonna form right, little meatballs. Form and you don't want to overmix your meatballs because you don't want them to get tough. We I do not like a tough meatball. Me neither. I don't Nobody either. does, right? Who likes so a tough meatball? That's, that's kind okay, of yeah, shape it a little prettier than you. that, you know. All right, like, you I'm shaping it. Watch this, watch this. Look at that, that's gorgeous. Oh my God, that Look is that. beautiful. Okay, right here. You can we, play basketball with you, that. Now, you know what, I just wanna say, this is fabulous food for you to be able to do it. You serve it like when the lions are killing the giants, like in one of those games, you know what I mean? <laughs> okay. Somebody okay, hold me, come hold, come me. Come okay. hold, hold me, hold me. Is this the part where I behave good because we're on television, right? <laughs> Right here. You can Come make on. that up to me by okay. feeding me. Okay, here you go. You take these meatballs, we throw them in the oven for about 15 minutes, mm -hmm. right? Cook them. Now we bring them out there cold. You dip them in the flour, right? Like this. Now you just shake off the excess flour. Mm -hmm. Then you have a waffle batter. You can do it out of a box. It's getting good. Or you can make it. Right. Throw it in there like that. Mm -hmm. You can stick your finger in there if you want. Or I will. I'll stick it in there. I can tell you. You took you, your you gloves off. You waited until I took the gloves off. I and, did. It. You, well, into you, a thick... You took the gloves off first, Chef. <laughs> yeah. This is good. This is going to be so good. Into hot oil. Whenever you're frying, you drop a little bit of the batter in there. Make mm -hmm. sure that it starts to bubble right away. Right. And then I just drop this waffle coated chicken croquette in there at like 375. Cook it till it gets golden brown. And then we do it with the syrup. You know, taste this, it, taste this, it, this, taste is, it. this is my favorite part oop, here. Oop, sorry. And it's warm, oh my God. And it's hot sauce with maple syrup and butter and a little bit of cream. <laughs> and then you pour it over that. Oh my God. Now here, I just want, now wait, there. I okay, better do a little bit more, right in there. Here, 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 here. I'm not sure there's enough. There you go, oh, there you go. You might need a little a bit, bit more, more. Chef. <laughs> Just a little bit. <laughs> All right, now, ready to taste one of these? No, yes, this? Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. could just, I could just have you that, could, that sauce that's on gonna everything. That's gonna be a little, yeah, now don't get it all oh, over Oh, and it's nice clothes. and crispy. Yeah, yeah. This is delicious, See? let's try it. Okay. Any good? <laughs> you know okay, what? Okay, don't get stuck on just a chicken and waffles. It gives you the joy of a funnel cake? Yeah. But you get the chicken. And the spiciness. And the spiciness and the sweetness yeah. of the maple. It's good, right? 
It's good. Okay, I won't, I won't hold it personally, all the things you said over there. <laughs> two feet away from him. If you tell me what we got here. Deviled eggs with a little bit of a spicy poblano salsa, and I make a tartar sauce for the mayonnaise and the egg yolk. It is yummy. The crowd loves and, this. Yeah, and this is great for that game, too, when they're, you know. The, 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 uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Do you want me to come to the restaurant or not? Because Go, okay, I'm not gonna okay, come okay, okay, okay. I won't be able to handle it, but then again, this is really good. <laughs> Well, I don't know. Let me taste it. Let's make sure this is good. Should we? Yeah. We got a tester, you know. It's not just TV. This is my palate. Mm. Does that work? That is nice. That is good, right? And it's not heavy. No, no, no. It's great. You didn't ruin the deviled egg. Don't you hate when people like... <laughs> Or they, this is delicious. The salsa makes great, it great, uh, and the bacon. Got come on now. Pickles in there, bacon on the top, little, olives inside the I like yeah. the little kick that there. That poblano pepper. Yeah, it's good. That's great. That's great, Jeff. Okay. Back to this though. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay I don't want to be. I don't want to be greedy. I'll share. I'll share this with you. Yeah, a little bit. A little bit more. Oh yeah. Yeah. A little bit more. Oh yeah. I'm gonna share some of this with you guys. You gotta taste this. Thank you so much. Thank you.